Hello everyone. In the last video, I showed you how to start a Cessna 172 in X-Plane 11. What good is starting a plane if you have nowhere to go? So now I'm going to show you how to build a flight plan. And the very first thing we're going to do is visit world-airport-codes.com, enter in the city that we'd like to leave from, and then enter in the city that we're going to arrive at. In this case, I've entered in Ottawa, and I can see that the airport code is CYOW. I've also entered Montreal, and its airport code is CYUL. So we'll take those pieces of information, and we'll go over to a website called simbrief.com. You will need an account to use Simbrief, so make sure you register before you try this. And once you do, click on Dispatch, and then Dispatch System. You'll now see the Dispatch options. Simbrief lets you select a departure and arrival airport and see what route someone else has already flew. So, in this case, I can see there's three or four suggested routes. I'm going to stick with the first one, click Analyze Route, and it tells me my distance is 87 nautical miles. If I scroll down, I'll also see that route plotted out with waypoints on the map. You got to be very careful though. Not all these routes are always correct, so I can tell you that the AVVON one is correct, however this one is not, and I'll show you how to tell. If you click on each waypoint, we know this is right, CYOW. Click on the second one, we know AVVON is right. However, when we get to the third one, notice that the airway is the one with the number 3, but the waypoint doesn't. So now we know that when we enter this into the GPS, we would enter HABBS and not with the 3 at the end. And lastly, we click on this and we can see it's CYUL, it's Montreal, that's where we're going. So, simbrief.com, you can enter in a departure and arrival airport and find routes that someone else has already flew. That's great, but what if you want to build your own route from scratch? There's a website called skyvector.com. So first things first, click on the world low button. And I've done the same thing. I've entered Ottawa to Montreal, and it shows me a direct line. So I'll zoom in, and I can see I'm going from Ottawa to Montreal. Now, I can go ahead and plug into here the same waypoints that I got from Simbrief, and I can now see them on the map, or I can decide to enter my own waypoints in. So if I look on the map here, and zoom in, I can see there's a waypoint here, there's a waypoint there, so I can now enter in any waypoint I want. So if I want a more direct waypoint, maybe instead of going this way through AVVON to HABBS, Maybe I'm just going to go directly over here to COMAU. So I'll delete these. COMAU. And now I have a direct route from Ottawa to COMAU to the airport. So now you get to choose how you want to fly. Do you want to fly a route that someone else has already built? That is simbrief.com. Or do you want to build your own route from scratch? That's skyvector.com. So now that you know how to build a flight plan, we'll close this video off, and in the next video I'll show you how to enter this flight plan into a GPS.